Hi friends, today is March 28th, 2020, where we're still practicing social distancing. And today I accept Charity Church's challenge number three to go through some old family albums together. And I love going through old family albums. As, as you go through them, you get to learn about relatives that you may have never even met. You can um, rekindle some of those good feelings about some of the happy moments that you've had in your life. And your kids can sit and laugh with you about how funny you used to look back then. To me, going through an old photo album is like getting into a time machine. And here's what I mean. So I open this up to one page, and suddenly I'm back in the 1950s which, by the way, is before I was born. Thank you. But I could just go ape over these nifty pictures. They've got it made in the shade. Now right here, he's a dreamboat with the ginchiest ducktail hairdo. And his cardigan sweater and penny loafers are just fab. And her bouffant hairdo is dreamy. And her poodle skirt is to die for. Her saddle shoes and bobby socks are just neato. And now we turn the page. And here we are making the scene in the 60s. Here's a groovy picture of a hippie with some far out threads. I dig those hip hugger bell bottoms. And look, he's sporting a fro with a pick right here. And some John Lennon shades, man. And here's his foxy old lady in hot pants and go-go boots. She's boss. And with a flip of the page, it's the 1970s. And here's a good-looking group chilling in their pad. Can you dig it? There's a disco ball in the background and a pet rock. I'm feeling good vibes checking out these mood rings. And there's a couple of foxy mamas with peasant blouses and chokers and Farrah Fawcett hairdos. Are you jiving me? There's a dork with a keep on trucking t-shirt. And right next to the guy is a guy with a mullet. And right next to him is a guy with a powder blue leisure suit. Let's get out of the 70s. Peace out, home fry, and go into the 80s. Sup. Gag me with a spoon. Look at these huge earrings. Whatever. This one's getting jiggy with some spandex pants. You go, girl. Not. Nah. Check out these gnarly parachute pants. They're totally bodacious. Duh. The guy with the mohawk is totally tubular. And these spikes are fly. All these girls look like football players with big shoulder pads in their jackets. But it'll be all right. Don't have a cow. All these girls are vegging out in their scrunchies and leg warmers. Which takes us to the 90s. Booyah! The 1990s are all that and a bag of chips. Props on the grungy outfits. Totally. And if you don't like it, talk to the hand. They don't really have any fashion fads in the 1990s. Psych. Sorry. My bad. Here's the 411 on fashion. Snap bracelets, platform shoes, camouflage, bucket hats, Sally sandal, jelly sandals, and of course, the Rachel haircut. Which brings us back to the 21st century. Through the years, a lot of things have changed in the world of fashion, the fads, the expression we use. The world is changing every day, and with the recent events, we have all come to realize that our world can change in just a moment. Hebrews 13 and 8 says, Jesus Christ the same yesterday, today, and forever. He will never change. When he walked this world, he healed the sick, he fed the hungry, he was moved with compassion, and he forgave sin. He will never change. During these uncertain, difficult times, please cry out to the Lord. He will never change. Trust Jesus. He cares. Thank you for watching our video. Please subscribe to our channel. And we'd really appreciate it if you'd share this video. Trust Jesus. He cares.